the head of the civil service of the Federation, Dr. Fulatele Emerson, my own head of service, the Director General of the Office, Dr. Ben Akarugwe, the Chief Medical Director, and the board, members of the Board of Luth, the staff, and all guests to this occasion. Today marks yet another milestone in the history of the Lagos University Teaching Hospital as we roll out the red carpet to welcome three very august ladies and gentlemen. The Honorable Minister of State here by representative, the head of the Civil Service of the Federation and the Director General Budget Office. I therefore consider it an honor to, on behalf of the management board and staff of the hospital, to welcome our August visitors warmly to the hospital and wish them a successful visit. Since the appointment of the current board of the hospital a few years ago, Lowe has been very lucky to receive many high Air Force visitors, including the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, who came and commissioned the Ultra Modern Cancer Center in 2018. The visits to us by these very important personalities have been the tonic that has kept us on our toes. And I must say, with no fear of contradiction, that we have responded positively to government's expectation of us as a hospital. <laughs> Among our strengths at Lewis is the fact that our location in a mega city like Lagos has opened our vista to modern management and public service provision techniques that are only tenable in a metropolis of this nature. These include the ability, the availability of the infrastructure that supports modern methods of doing things, exploitation of the size of the city in attracting high network projects through corporate social responsibility awareness, provision of services that can only be provided by hospitals in a metropolitan area, and the availability of good leadership. I want to tell each and every one of us here that we have a good dose of each and every one of the qualities I mentioned. We are also very proud of our staff, both administrative and professional, whose services have been instrumental in attracting well-meaning Nigerians and their foreign friends to, a, to embark on projects meant to enrich the quality of services for whom we have been set up. Let me use this occasion to thank all those who trust our judgment and services for believing in our abilities. This includes the Alima Atta family, the investment that you have done in this hospital will not be in vain, I can assure you. And every Nigerian who has an issue has the opportunity to come here and test what I've just said. Once again, it is my honor to welcome you, all our visitors to the hospital, and wish them a very fruitful deliberation. Thank you very much.